Got a question. Do you do it for the looks or do you do it for all the other benefits? You know, improving your health, mobility, reducing stress, building strength, all that type of stuff. No more slip, trip and break a damn hip. Or do you just do it because it looks good? You got muscles, you can, you got no more cottage cheese at the bottom of the butt cheeks when you take that bathroom selfie in your G-string. So what do you do it for? I think a lot of us still are confused by this screwed up message that the fitness industry gives us. And that is, it's all about the look. It's far from it. When we get older, clearly it's, it's not a look thing. I mean, seriously, I know that there's a message out there around um, markets people to let them know that they can have more sex, they can have more money, or they can have more prestige. Well, if you're an older person, you probably by now, maybe you found a partner who really probably doesn't give a fuck about what you look like. If they still love and care for you, you're probably still going to have some level of intimacy. If you are an older person, you don't give a shit about driving around the fancy car. I know that was me too for a bit, and after mine got T-boned, I couldn't give a shit. So when it comes to the fitness side of the things, I want you to stop thinking about what it means to look a certain way and focus on all the other benefits. Maybe then we wouldn't keep fucking ourselves up and going on this continuous hamster wheel every time we don't get the results that we think that we're going to get in this short, stupid space of time. In 28 days, lose four kilos in four weeks. Congratulations. Go on a diuretic, take Pico Prep, shit yourself out for the day, and you're going to lose four kilos. But you won't feel better about yourself. The problem that we have is that we look for fucking quick fixes and it's not a quick fix. It's a long freaking game. I want to be here longer. I want to be here longer so that when my kids have their kids and I'm a granddad, maybe then I can get down the floor and I can play with them. Instead of being some geriatric piece of shit, broken down hips, fucked up metabolism and all the types of shit that the industry is pitching to you, all as part of the quick fixes. Seriously. If you've been on this earth longer than 30 or 40 years, by now you're probably a little bit mature. Then fucking well act like it. Stop falling for the stupid shit, the skinny teas, the detoxes, the 28 day challenges to turn your fucking life around. It's taken you 40 years to get to where you fucking well are. So from me to you, Maybe if you focus on the other benefits, the other outcomes, the no longer slip, tripping and breaking your hip, then maybe then you'll stay on this goddamn wheel and be consistent a little bit every day for the rest of your life.